Hello everyone, this is Kat with Cat Night TV. Today we are playing Minecraft Story Mode, and we are on episode 4, Block and Hard Place. This is my personal playthrough, and this is part 12. Let's get going. So many books! We should be careful. This place could be booby-trapped. Let's just start looking for the enchanting book. How to train your slime. The various uses of mushrooms too. Potionology, volume 24. None of these are enchanting books. A brief history of cubism. Crafting for noobs. <laughs> Revised. A collector's guide to precious gems. Oh, none of these seem to be enchanting books either. Olivia, any luck? Not really. Ivor has too many books, and there's too few of us looking. How did we end up all split up like this? I feel like we're spreading ourselves too thin. I miss how things used to be. That first night we all spent together? Lucas left because he had to. He said he owed it to his friends. I get that. I'd do the same thing for you guys. For the right price, of course. Of course. What's the point of friendship if it doesn't pay? See? This is why we get along so well. Find anything yet? Huh, in this mess? Uh, it's as though Ivor learned nothing from my lectures on organizational methodology. If only he hadn't gotten lost in that confounded swamp. He could just tell us where the book is. Coming here was his idea. He should be here for it. He was just doing what I asked. It wasn't his fault we got separated. Not really. Is that supposed to make me feel better? There's neither rhyme nor reason to how these books are stored. Finding anything here is impossible. Tedious, maybe. Impossible? No way. Fine, I will continue this monotonous search. But I reserve my right to grumble about it. It's a deal. As if I could stop you. Need a Ruben? Ruben, what are you doing? <laughs> Yeah, well, you're gonna get yourself cooked. I've told you before, stay away from lava. <laughs> hey, Olivia, I think there's some redstone over here. Looks like a circuit. We probably just need a lever to power it. <sighs> Too bad I don't have one. Yeah. No lever, no functioning circuit. Hmm. Wonder what's in there. Let's just look and open it, actually. Other Wood than planks. Those will be useful. This Ivor character, I'm recalling that he knew something about potions. Could one of these stop the wither monsters? I'm remembering correctly, am I not? What do you remember? I seem to recall that Ivor was better with potions than people, and he... he... Keep going. Ah, nothing else is coming. Besides the whole Ivor being a jerk thing. Potion of blindness, potion of dullness, potion of nausea. None of these will help me. Jesse, am I going to be all right, or is this just who I am now? Of course you'll be okay. You're Gabriel the warrior. Thank you, Jesse. Your confidence in me is stronger than any potion. Except perhaps a potion of confidence. I wonder if he has one of those. <laughs> hmm. 
first I'll need some sticks. Okay, sticks. got the sticks. There we go. A good old fashioned lever. Lever, lever. Whatever. Oh, excuse me, Ruben. There we go. Like it was made for it, which it was. Let's see what this sucker does. build a secret passage in a house that nobody ever visits more like why wouldn't you secret passageways are cool good point Gathered them all in one place. Gathered... what exactly? The treasures of the Order of the Stone! Oh, the stories I could tell about these dusty old things. I don't see any enchanting books, though. Maybe through there. Uh, locked, of course. There must be some way to open it. Ivor have the treasures of the Order of the Stone. Did he steal them? No, 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 no. We, we let him keep them when we split up. You let him keep your treasures? Frankly, Jesse, it's a long story. Soren, is this the actual Ender Dragon Egg? Huh. Alas, yes. The only thing that remains of our final adventure together. Jesse, what are you doing? Uh, taking this really cool rare item. We might need it to unlock that door. Uh, very well. Just be careful with it. See? Am I crazy? Or is this a sea lantern? Ah! The very same one the Order built all those years ago. Oh, we were so green back then. It looks just as bright as on the day we crafted it. A sea lantern, huh? These are prismarine crystals. You can only get these underwater, right? Precisely. We nearly ran out of oxygen getting these. <laughs> Eligard had to use a spare bucket just to grab a few extra breaths. We used most of these to craft a sea lantern. This is all that remained. Prismarine is such a cool word. Prismarine. So where'd this packed ice come from? Well, we brought it back from the Ice Plains Spikes biome. It was colder there than anywhere we'd ever been, but <laughs> Magnus slipped so many times our laughter kept us warm. After that, we knew we were ready to face the Ender Dragon. Ooh, cold and slippery. Oh. 
these gas tears. They're super hard to get. You don't know the half of it. It was our first official mission as the Order of the Stone. We fought those ghasts for hours, and these tears were our reward. Wow. Just gonna borrow this. Aha! A hopper! Why is Ivor hiding a hopper in his basement? Ender Dragon Egg. So cool. Let's act ice. Let's put it here. Sea Lantern. In you go. Prismarine Crystals. Into the hopper. Yes! You solved it. But how in the world did you know what order to put them in? There were 120 possible combinations. It was all in the Order's history. The Order of the Order, so to speak. Nice work, Jesse. On the puzzle, I mean. Not, not the joke. <laughs> you know, I often give Ivor a hard time, but for all his complaining, his time with the Order clearly meant a great deal to him. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, let's go get that enchanting book. By the stars, the Ender Dragon, with replica Ender Crystals and all. I always wondered what it looked like. Hmm. No way out. Soren, what's this thing supposed to be? It appears to be an homage to our battle with the Ender Dragon. Despite his anger, Ivor never stopped being fond of us. <laughs> he was a big part of our team, after all. He knows his days in the Order were his finest. Are these supposed to be the Ender Crystals? Scale models of them. They were the secret to the dragon's demise. The secret, huh? Maybe you should tell me the whole story. Ha. Huh. If only you'd been there. It was a fight for the ages. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle ever. But even so... Ender Dragon was stronger than even I had imagined. I realized that it was drawing strength from the Ender Crystals, and that the crystals had to be destroyed. I hit the first with a perfectly placed arrow. The second I destroyed by launching myself on the shockwave of Magnus's TNT. Using only my strength and my wiles, I steered the foul beast toward the third crystal. I flew the dragon directly toward the final crystal. Only then did Gabriel deliver his famous final blow. Yeah. We became heroes, and eventually, legends. The greatest the world has ever known. You? did all that. Indeed I did. They didn't call us the Order of the Stone for nothing. Hmm. Wonder if that story will help me solve this puzzle. So Soren rode the dragon, huh? Ruben, do you know what to do here? Oh well, it was worth a shot. Boost, will ya? <laughs> Aha! Aha! 
There's another door? Dragon. Right, Soren? They kept them. The fool actually kept them. He looked me in the eye and swore. He Soren, you said destroying these crystals was the key to defeating the Ender Dragon. You did kill the Ender Dragon, right? Jesse, this isn't this isn't what it looks like. Our story. Uh, the story. It's it's mostly true. I swear, I swear it. Whatever you're thinking. I promise I can explain. Soren, I want the truth. And I want it now! I, I can't. We swore never to speak of it. I don't care! <sighs> I'm afraid I haven't been honest with you, We did defeat the Ender Dragon, but it wasn't exactly like I said. How not exactly? We got rid of it, but... We didn't kill it, per se. In fact, we didn't even fight it. So what did you do to it? We didn't do anything! We used that damned command block! You used the command block to defeat the Ender Dragon? I'm afraid so. Understand, when I found that blasted block, we were nobodies. But with its help, we became stronger, faster. We could do so much more. The others had no idea what I was doing. Yet the more I used it, the more we came to depend on it. I knew it was only so long before someone would find out. a plan. I would use the command block to blink the Ender Dragon out of existence. Securing our status as legends forever. We told the world we defeated a dragon. Soren, I looked up to you. The whole world did. Nobody is more ashamed than me. So you finally admit it. Soren, how could you? I... How long have you guys been standing there? Long enough that they heard the whole thing. So we're liars. All of us. You didn't think you could keep it secret forever, did you, Soren? The truth hurts, doesn't it? 
Is this why you left the Order? Because Soren lied. Because they all did. Soren, Gabriel, Magnus, Eligard, they agreed to keep this a secret. No conniving of us. And you, you agreed to stay quiet too, in exchange for all of our treasures. <gasps> I've technically never told anybody. Jesse discovered the truth on her own. So this whole thing, the wither you unleashed, it's all been to teach the Order a lesson? To teach the world a lesson. To show you who the Order really are. Liars, cowards. And now, they know. And how is that any better? You reveal their lies at the expense of the world itself. Um, my wither plan obviously backfired. You think? I didn't know we'd end up with three of those things tearing the world apart. For a moment, I nearly forgot. Look. Right now, my friends are out there facing that monster you created. So however we got here, we need to move on. Jesse's right. Destroying the command block is all that matters anymore. How ironic that the best thing the command block gave us was the very means to destroy it. Spare us the poetry. It's not your strong suit. I've had this book for years. So, the enchanting book. What do we do with it? You craft a weapon, then put it on an anvil. Follow me. I'll show you. Ivor, I'm sorry. About everything. Yes, well, it doesn't matter now. Grab some ingredients and craft a weapon. I'll show you how to enchant it. Sweet. Let's see what Ivor's got in here. Let's see. There's a bunch of crafting stuff and... Diamonds! Score! So I can craft whatever I want, huh? Anything at all. An axe? Guess I could craft another sword. A pickaxe. Old shovel. A hoe. <laughs> None of those things. Awesome. I've never owned a diamond weapon. Just wait till you enchant it. Let's see what this enchanting book is made of. Enchanted Diamond Sword. Yes, that should do the job nicely. If you're fighting those Wither Monsters head on, you'll want better armor too. I enchanted these for the Order. They're about as strong as it comes. Even able to withstand TNT. Any preference? I have eight different sets to choose from. Then believe me, they're all excellent. Let me take a look at them. It's okay. all quite durable. And sturdy. Ugh. Oh, Dragon's pain. Even the Ender Dragon would have fled from this in terror. I call this one the Shield of Infinity. In no small part because it's infinitely cool. This is Swordbreaker. All but the strongest of weapons would shatter against it. <laughs> I call this one the Ender Defender. Very strong against an Enderman's attack. That's the Redstone Riot. Engineered to be virtually indestructible. This one is named Golden Goliath. As bright and powerful as the sun itself. This one. I call this the Star Shield. No object in the universe can penetrate it. The Adamantine Impervium. 
even harder to damage than it is to pronounce. <laughs> Definitely gotta go with purple. It's my favorite color. All right, this is the set. Yes, a fine choice. Now go ahead and put it on. You can take some for your friends as well. Sounds good to me. Wow, cool armor, Jesse. Thanks. And there's plenty to go around. Now, let's get back to Soren's fortress and see how the Wither Storms are doing against those Endermen. Well, that's it for part 12. We'll be back with part 13 soon. We're getting close to the end of episode 4. So make sure you subscribe for more and hit the like button if you enjoyed it. And have a great day.